Rails, Rail Fanning Adventure. On October 29th, 2023, we decided to head to Tweetsie Railroad for their last day of the Wild West season. Following the train that day was locomotive number 12. We rode the last trip of the day. Before we did, we caught the second to last train of the day departing the station. We're going to ride car number 3 for the best view of the show. The train is clear, Stacey. Here we go, folks. You should have stayed in your seats. How about you? The train returns to town for the 5 o'clock train. started with a Wild West train ride, being as you're already here. You're sitting behind a real cold, burning steam locomotive, so you might just get a painful cinder in your eye. The good folks at the first aid station will be happy to help get it out for you. Following our train today is locomotive number 12, built in 1917 by the Baldwin Locomotive Works of Philadelphia. From 1918 to 1940, Tweetsie ran on the East Tennessee and Western North Carolina Railroad, or ETNWNC, between Johnson City, Tennessee, and Boone. Folks back then used to say proudly that ET and WNC also stood for every time and with no complaint. During the troubles of the Great Depression, local folks joked that it could also stand for eat taters and wear no clothes. The train earned the nickname Tweetsie because of the sound of its whistle echoing through these mountains. We've got another locomotive just in case old number 12 needs a rest. Her name is the Yukon Queen and her number is 190. 
Before we get started, I just want to remind you to stay in your seats while the train is moving, and be sure to keep your arms and head inside the train cars at all times. You never know when a desperado or tree limb might just sneak up on you. We want you all to be safe and have fun riding your Tweetsie Railroad. Also know that smoking is not allowed on the train, except of course for the engine. Our train will be leaving the station in just a few minutes, so be sure to stay in your seats. Riding the train with you today are the Tweetsie Cowboys and Cowgirls. They're going to introduce themselves to you and tell you anything else you might need to know. We're so glad you're here today, and we hope you enjoy your ride on the Tweetsie Railroad. All aboard the Tweetsie Railroad. Casey Jones, let's ride. The train is clear, Casey. Here we go, folks. Be sure to stay in your seats. How about giving the people in town a wave and a big yee-haw? is the Tweetsie Junction, a handmade sign shop, and you can see some entertaining shows at the Palace Saloon. Over on your left is the Hacienda, where we'll be having lots of great special events throughout the season, along with some other surprises.
Keep your eyes peeled. Never know what might happen when a train stops in the middle of the wilderness. reports about them today, so if you see any of them, I want you to scream, shout, and holler, okay? Yeah, just like that. Hey, behind me? Okay, I'll take a look. There ain't nobody there. You're pulling my leg. Now look, you can't play games with the sheriff. Look, are you sure? Yeah. All right, I'm going to count three. I'm going to turn around really fast, okay? One, two, three. Well, that ain't a single soul. Y'all are just full of cotton candy. Now, I'm a busy man. I got a job to do. No more fooling around. Hey, Lester! Why is it dark in here? Lester! Why is Cut it? Cut it out, Sheriff! Oh! You did! You did! Oh! Oh! And stay it. Why didn't y'all tell me that thing about me? Come on, you. Ha ha. Come here. Woo! Woo! Get out there! Huh. 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 Looks like I got the drop on you. Now get to stuffing. I'm so glad you asked. Folks on the train, if you know it, say it with us. My name is Texas Pete. And this here is my little brother Tabasco. And together, we are the Flaming Hot Sauce Bandits. Chop, 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 chop. Oh, and I'm Cayenne, and I've come to rob the train. Cayenne, you're Mr. Q. <laughs> Tabasco. Ooh. Now, tell me, 
What's he playing to here, Sarah? That gold? I'm going to get me a long stem rose from this amethyst up to the palace. Oh, boy, some fudge. Some fudge, huh? Oh, or a new saddle. A saddle? You don't know how to ride a horse. We can steal a new one. Uh, you two, stop where you're going. Tabasco. What's in the box? Ooh, two bags of gold. Two bags of gold? How am I supposed to retire with two bags of gold? Where's the rest of it? I don't know. I don't know where it's at. Looks like I'm gonna your stupidity. Now, why don't you two get that box back on the train? Tabasco! Texas Pete! Texas Pete! I just got a telegram. All the rest of the gold's at Fort Boone. Thank you, sweetheart. We already learned that. Now, get on the back of the train and tie up the conductor. Tabasco! I want you to take care of the passengers. Okay, take care of them? Take care of them. Okay, uh, hey folks, my name is Tabasco, I'll be taking care of a book, and I'll be starting with a coat for a pet suit, to do any super salad. Tabasco! What? Take care of them in a meaningful way. Okay, uh... You're getting a suit! You're getting a salad, and you don't even get to look at the menu! Tabasco, get on the train. I'll take it from here. All right, ladies and gentlemen, me and my compadres rode up and down the train cars collecting your valuables. We're talking dollar bills, we're talking coins, and we can cash in checks. Mr. Conductor, if you don't want a Wild West whooping, you better take me to Fort Boone. Folks, these bandits don't look none too friendly. It's probably best to stay in your seat and try to stay out of their way. Casey Jones, I don't want a Wild West whooping. Let's take this train on up to Fort Boone. conductor on this train for a mighty long time now. And I've seen many an outlaw try to rob the old Tootsie train, but not one has ever been successful. Till now. It looks like anyone's going to be coming to our rescue, and it looks like the bad guys have finally won.
this looks dessert. Sauce bandits took over the train, brought us up here, tied us up, now we're in the fort trying to get that gold. Yeah. Yeah, the do 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 You two stay out here looking for the box. All right. Ready, team? One, two, three, break. Hey, Bugs, where are you? I know you're around here somewhere. Someone say my name? Yeah. Now where have you been? You're supposed to be guarding this fort and that gold. Now where's that? Ooh, the gold. That's the best part, Sheriff. See, I hid the gold where no one will find it. I put a sign on it that says not gold. This breaks the bench. Told you. Yeah. You gotta be kidding. Oh, get over here. Come on. We gotta take care of these hot sauce. Tabasco. Yeah, Texas Pete. Tabasco. Texas Pete. Have you seen that gold anywhere? No, I ain't seen the gold nowhere. Huh. What about you? know what I felt like? What? They had a whole surplus of these scented candles. Let me see them. TNT dynamite Alex. You idiot. This is dynamite. Oh, oh hey, oh, 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 hey, wait a minute. This thing's dangerous, don't you know? Wait a minute. How'd you three get untied? Uh, we got loose. How'd you get loose? Oh, well, the marshal's afraid of course. Oh, <laughs> I haven't seen the marshal in years. Oh, oh yeah? Listen, we're going to have to get over there. Wait a minute, we're going to stop like that. Wait a minute, what? What? Let me go, get out! Where'd she go? Oh, God, there's a charge! Come here! Get me, get me! Deputy! Open this door! Huh, what are you doing? Open the door and fight! Look at me, I'm going to see you tomorrow! Year. I may be back one day, but not next year. And um, 
Wow, I didn't think I'd get this far. <laughs> All right. Um, I just want to say I love this job my entire life. When I heard about it when I was in college, I'll give you a story. My college roommate broke down the door, said, hey, we're going to audition. And I said, okay, and now I'm here. So, this is an amazing job, and I just want to thank all of y'all who have been here with it. I want to thank um, Chris and Kathy Robbins, HR, John Allen Setzer for even hiring me, and of course, my friends on the train crew, Mr. Conductor, Casey Jones, I guess the horse riders, and all the cowpoke who have been out here with me for either four years, one year, two years, three years, the one sitting on the train car crying right now. So, I just want to thank you all, and uh, Walker Sky's not dead. He'll be back one day. All right, all right, I guess I'll go next. Um, something I'd like to say is that it's been a lifelong dream to work here. I've been here for four seasons, and I can say at the bottom of my heart, there is no other job that I'd love more than being a Tweety Road Cowboy. It's amazing. I love it so much. I love the regulars that come on the train. Uh, I love you guys so much. Uh, if it weren't for you guys, uh, I don't know where I'd be right now. So I want to thank the customers. Uh, go ahead and give yourselves a round of applause, y'all. Because if it weren't for you guys, there would be no Tweety Railroad. But uh, yeah, so I want to thank you guys again. Uh, Casey Jones, thank you. Mr. Conductor. No, I've been making your train late all season long, but we made it through, right? <laughs> That's right. That's right. Um, yeah, I don't know if this will be it for me or not, but I just want to say that no matter what happens, Yosemite Brooks will always live on. So. All right, y'all. I guess that anybody else got anything you'd like to say? You <laughs> You're forgetting about something. What are we forgetting about? The final bow. We do the final year. bow. All right. Guys, line on up. We got one more bow. So All right. Come on. Come on, come on in. Come on in. Marshall, no, horse, you do, stay over there. Do the best you can. All right. <laughs> All right. Let's see if we all went to theater school and learned this. Three, two, one. Up. Down. All right. I've been running this for four years. Everyone with me. One last time. Casey Jones. Let's ride. Woo! All right, everyone, please return to your seats and have a great big round of applause for the Queens of Cowboys, Cowgirl, and Trooper Box. <laughs> Casey Jones, let's get this train on back to town.
the settlers in the area lived in simple log cabins, much like this one. They're small and have dirt floors, but they kept the family cozy and warm during the harsh mountain winters.
at this time of the safety exit out the rear of your train cars. Thanks for making it a great 2023 season here at Quincy Railroad. Quincy Christmas begins November 24th. Happy trails to you and yours until we meet again. Thanks for watching. I hope you liked what you saw. If you did, please like, comment, and subscribe. And ring the notification bell to be notified about my future uploads. Uh -huh.